Hey gang, uh, we are back here with some uh, metal work at OCD Hi-Fi Guy. I'm going to show you real quick just a kind of a distinction between some sort of basic metal work and then some fine metal work. Okay, so this, they're both um, aluminum, okay, and this one we can see, you know, see how it's kind of like sparkly? It's got sort of a little sort of a texture to it. Okay, um, it's thick. If we look in, like between here, we can see it's it's really thick. It's maybe, um, well, you come to the edge, see? And then we can get, uh, it's maybe, a, let's see, an eighth, you know, it looks like it's an eighth. Um, and, um, but anyways, if we rub our, our fingers across this, it feels like you can feel little, like, speckles of something. Like, you can feel it grabbing your, your, uh, you're catching your fingerprint, okay? Um, and then, like, right here... We're looking at something that is very finely grained. This, when you rub your fingers across it, it feels like silk. I mean, it's so smooth. This one, it's a little rough, okay? So you can kind of see if we stand back a little bit, you can see one sort of matte or, or like satiny, satin, and then the other one's sort of a little more sparkly. Um, so th th this is much more, this is more expensive for sure. Because it's so nicely machined. I mean, that is what I'm trying to get up. There's grain, okay? So I don't know if you can tell, but there's grain in this. Anytime there's grain in aluminum, it means they have to run it on sandpaper, basically. It's like a giant belt of sandpaper, and they get this. But to get this kind of a, of a fineness, man, without deep scratches, without any mess, anything messed up, you can, you can look across and you see just there's no, there's no errors. There's no blemishes. So this is very high-end machining um you can just tell um and then looks there's even like looks like a, there's a little bevel or a chamfer they call it where um, i'm trying to get this edge here see if i can get it mm, let's see okay well basically it just means that like there's no hard edge so on on this if you rub your fingers down the, the corner like that or down the edge they've knocked that hard edge off that means they put a little 45 just down the edge to take that hard edge off so that when you touch it it doesn't it doesn't your fingers don't catch it. Your fingers just slide right over it with that little chamfer. Um, and um, and then we might as well take this as an example. Okay, so here is sort of a mid-level um, uh, chassis. Okay, it's very beautiful. It's very nice. It's heavy and it's aluminum. But remember how I taught you before, or t showed you before, if you come over here, you see how there's these screws that, that show right on the top. That means this is one plate. Okay, and then we come over here to the side. Okay, and we see there's that line that I told you about. Okay, and then we come back to, let's see, I want to cover that up. Okay, we come back here, and there's that other line. So you can you can see how thick the metal is. That shows you that it's high quality. Um, see, there's a little chamfer on that edge, too. Um, you can also um, see that it's plate. See how there's a plate on the bottom, there's a plate on the side, there's a plate on the top. So that is that is higher grade than standard because of its thickness and because of the, the you know how how this is done with the that must be paint um but um but it's still considered like a quick and quick you know it, it, it's not high end high end high end high end would never have screws on the top it would not have it would it would be like out of billet or it would have this would be um you'd at least have a um, radius edge that went down and then your line would be down here somewhere and you'd attach that to the side where there would be no obvious line right at where the two meet, okay? Um, so that just shows you a little bit more, expands on our, um, you know, how to tell the high, high end from the mid high end or whatever. Just, I'm showing you differences in manufacturing. So um, that is um, a little, another little, Thing about aluminum and sheet aluminum versus machined billet. Okay, all right, talk to you guys later. See you.